I love my people, Lady Rose from the United States of America here. It's been a minute since you all saw me. <laughs> yeah, I got a little bit busy and, uh, um, well, you saw me yesterday. No, it was Monday. So you saw me on the weekend. So, guys, what's going on, African brothers and sisters? What are we doing to our brothers? So, guys, with this story today, a brother called me from uh, Zimbabwe. So our brother from Zimbabwe got robbed by another brother from Kenya. Pretending to be an investor, I do not know. He has a, a company called uh, uh, WorldBitInvestment.com. WorldBit Investment is their homepage, is the name of the agency. And uh, I'm not sure why the agency has like a multiple name because the other name is, is uh, a Sky International. I believe the Sky International is the name of the agent because that's the person I saw on the profile. I can't, I couldn't tell if it's a woman or a female, but uh, the money was sent to Dennis Krap Lonyang. That Dennis Krap Lonyang is from Kenya. He lives in Nairobi. His address is Kenya Nairobi 001100. Brothers, Dennis Krap Lonyang, who are you? Are you a fake uh, ID holder in uh, uh, Mombasa? In, no, not the, in Mombasa, in Nairobi? Are you scamming people online? We're just going to expose your uh, scamming agency right now. Your fake agency. It's called uh, uh, <laughs> WorldBit Investment. So you know what that WorldBit Investment is telling you? They are telling you to bring in, if you give $10, $10 you're going to get $100. If you give $100, you're going to get $1,000. You give $200, you're going to get $2,000. I mean, seriously, guys, brothers and sisters, come to work. Join our charity. Join the Africa Charity TV USA. Stop wasting your time with those scammers. They are going to steal from you. Like this brother, he called me from Zimbabwe. He got scammed by a brother in Kenya, Nairobi. Dennis Krupp Lonyang. If you are in the group where somebody is promising you investment, they are... So guys, like, uh, why are you believing in stuff like that, my brothers and my sisters? Why are you believing in scammers? There are no free money out there. There is nothing free on this planet. You know, I've been on this planet for a minute, but I'm telling you, I do not believe if there's anything out there. I do not believe if there's anyone giving people money out there. So this company that belongs to, I believe, to this Dennis Krapolonyang from Kenya, Nairobi, I believe this company was uh, uh, the certificate of corporation. It says uh, Sky International Investment. One company has five names. That's a red flag, people. A company cannot sustain five names at once. The agent is calling his name or her name Sky International. And that's what the, pro the profile states. And the business name is World, World Bid Investment. It's just scary already. That already is raising a red flag, guys. Dennis Kraplonyang took money from this brother from Zimbabwe. F for the first time on a February 10th or 11th, 2024, Dennis took $109. On the, on March the 2nd, 2024, Dennis Kropelonyang took $150. As of yesterday, March 5th, 2024, 
Dennis Krop Lonyang took $50 from the brother from Zimbabwe and he blocked the brother from Zimbabwe. You know, all those scammers, they have the same technique. They take your money and then they block you. My brothers, my sisters, there's nothing free. So if you guys are in the group or is are you if you are dealing with this person, the person who's going to send you their name and the person lives in Nairobi, Kenya, their name is, uh, his name is Dennis Kropolonyang. Do not give him your money. He took the money, all this money from the brother from Zimbabwe and blocked the brother. And now they have no contact with each other, but I have the emails and I have the address of the Western Union. I have the address of, uh, um, uh, 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 this Dennis, I'm going to contact the Western Union. So guess what? Dennis Krop Lonyang, I will find you. I'm going to contact the police in Kenya, Nairobi. You have two options. Call the brother in Zimbabwe. You know him. You took money from him three times. Okay. The first time you took money on on February, I believe it's 18 or 10th, 2024. You took $109. The second time you took the uh, you took his money on March 2nd, 2024, you took $150. And yesterday you took $50 and you blocked him. Where is the invested money? He gave you the money, didn't he? And I have the Western Union address where he sent that money in Zimbabwe. It's a POSB, Masvingo, uh, that's in Zimbabwe. And I have the name of the bank. We're going to catch you. So, Dennis, you got my number up there. You have the email of uh, our uh, nonprofit, Africa Charity TV USA, at gmail.com. Contact me there. And reimburse that money. Give that brother's money before anything gets late. Before it's too late, give that money, okay? Capiche? Because we're not playing with you. We're going to catch you. We're going to put money out there to catch you. And uh, you are in Nairobi. Dennis Kropolonyang. Give the brother's money. and uh, Or email me there. Uh, send the money to me. So I could give the money back to the brother. We're going to find you no matter what. So Dennis Kropolonyang, we're going to find you. I told you. I gave you two options. One option. Call the brother in Zimbabwe. Give his money back. And the other option, we're going to find you with the uh, uh, Nairobi police. Yeah, I won't let that fly by like that. Y'all can't sit down there and start eating from people. You can't just sit down there stealing from your own brothers. What's wrong with you Africans? Why do you do that to your own brother? This is terrible.